So guys, this is some of the footage of my watch web shooter that I showed you guys last time I had a video. Um, it's pretty cool. And there's some slow-mo footage for you guys, so just uh, you can enjoy that. So this is a new formula I put together. It's pretty much the same as the last one. Xanthan gum and water, but I added um, shaving cream and uh, shampoo. So what I'm get, hoping to get from that is a little more expansion because those contain surfactants, which help those products foam up. In the frantic days that follow, the ingenious youth creates his web shooter. So one problem that I was encountering when building web shooters was how would I reload a web shooter? I mean, you see Peter Parker has those cartridges that he just pushes in. And so one uh, solution that I came up with, uh, with the help of the Spectacular, was to have a cartridge that is capped by a valve. And I'll show that to you guys now. So after screwing the cartridge in, what you do is you want to close, or I mean open, the valve in order to open the cartridge up to the solenoid valve. So it's actually like having two valves. So you have the valve that's capping the cartridge and you have the solenoid valve which releases the fluid when the, when the other valve that's capping the cartridge is open. Hold these on your belt or on your backpack or wherever you want. And you see I'm, uh, I'm about to shoot some from it, so just enjoy this footage. So here's something exciting from that formula I showed you in the first clip of the new formula from this video. Basically, when it dries up, and I'm not sure exactly how long it takes, and it does take a pretty long time given that, but when it dries up, it's solid, and the best part, it's fibrous. It's like very weak fibers of cloth. And this is the next step to a shooter that can actually shoot web-like material. The final thing I'm going to show you is uh, some footage from when I was out earlier this week. Uh, I added plasticizer to the formula that I showed you earlier. And basically what that is is it increases the plasticity and the fluidity of the material. And as you can see, it's a little bit more liquid, wow. but it is a little bit more plastic. Now for those of you who didn't know, Spider Device created a website because the website that is featured in my first video Real Web Tech is now defunct. So please, I encourage you to go to this website. That's spiderdevice.webs.com. It is a pretty, pretty well put together website. It has a forum section, has a picture section. On the front page, it features the videos, the latest videos of me, Spectacular, and Spider Device. It's, it, it has nothing on it yet, really. I posted a picture, and the only two members so far are me and Spider Device I saw, but Everyone, go to this website and register. You don't, it's free to register. Go register because this could be a treasure trove of information for creating web shooters. And that's all I have to say. See you guys next time.